Now we have the new Mr. Putin. Uh, I looked at the pictures of Mr. Putin, trying to look for a trace of humanity. Um, <laughs> I should, within a few weeks, have known better because you know what happened. They had the terrible tragedy of the submarine going down straight to the, to the floor. Whether there was an explosion inside or not, we don't know. But it was very interesting what happened. If ever there's a calamity in the West, the whole of the armed forces will go, they'll take everything there immediately. The politicians immediately will get together and say, what help do we want? They can have anything we can give. If we haven't got the help, we'll get it from someone else. There would be anxiety because what mattered was not the submarine, but the lives of those in. And the interesting thing was that the new leader of the Soviet Union didn't act quickly. This was very soon the comment. He didn't try to mobilize everyone else. We didn't know whether we could help, but we were all ready to go and help and sent some of the small submarines that we had just for such an occasion. But that, my friends, was very, very revealing indeed. They still do not value human life in the same way that we do. And so, all the help got there, I'm afraid, really rather late. And I'm a very relieved in one way that Mr. Putin got so much criticism for what he should have done but didn't. And that again shows that the Soviet Union and the peoples of the Soviet Union are very much aware of what could be done, a great deal more could be done than is being done at the moment.